So, uh, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm going to be bringing you a massive summer book haul. These books I picked up over June and July mostly, so I'm just going to show you what I've picked up. The first one is Me, Earl, and the Dying Girl by Jesse Andrews, and uh, I was super excited to pick this one up. I got it off Book Depository for my boyfriend to celebrate the end of his exams, and he loved it, he enjoyed it, he thought it was super funny. Um, I don't know anything about this book, but um, I assume it's about these three people, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm super excited to read this in the upcoming months. The next book depository book I got was The Wrath and the Dawn by Renee Audier. Uh, there's a funny story behind this because I ordered this cover from Book Depository but in soft cover because I love soft covers. But they had listed it wrong on their website and it came to me with this cover, uh, the purple and then the girl on the front. And I really was wanting the one with the red because it has these cool designs. And um, so I got it returned and I got the hardcover instead, um, which I'm really happy with and I'm really excited to be reading this in my upcoming um, Read the mall -thon reading challenge. But I know it's about um, a retelling of Arabian Nights. Next I got Red Rising by Pierce Brown. Um, this is also from Book Depository. I got it because I had like a 10% off discount with them um, and so I ordered this one and I'm super excited to get into this. I've heard it's like some people's favorite series that they've recently read and uh, I think all the books are out now so I'm hoping to start this soon and uh, get into the series. The last thing that I got from Book Depository was uh, with the discount code that I used from participating in the Booktubeathon, and that happened in like end of July. And so they had a couple books on there for that week of the Booktubeathon that were discounted. Um, and uh, so I picked up Illuminae by Jay Kristoff and Amy Kaufman. Um, this I'm also reading in my Read the Mall Thon reading challenge and um, check that out. I'll leave a link to that down below. And I'm super excited to read this. Um, all I know is that it is, I think, based in space, has something to do with spaceships or something like that. So I'm excited to see what all the talk is about around Illuminae. Next I picked up Attachments by Rainbow Rowell. Um, I got this from the website Better World Books. Better World Books. I got an email from them saying what my book purchase had contributed to um, charity wise so I was pretty happy with my purchase um, but it is a tiny bit pricey. Um, it does have a big scratch across the front here um, but for a used book it's not bad. So it's about a guy who works in, um, he monitors emails in an office and he sees a correspondence between two women in the office and I think he falls in love with one of them so that's what this story is about I think. Next I picked up a couple things from Kijiji um, so that I don't know if it's worldwide but at least in Canada it's sort of like Craigslist but um, yeah there, it's like a buy and sell um, marketplace so I found a couple people selling books in my area and um, so I picked up um, really cheap um, the Murder Complex and the Death Code. Um, both of these together were five dollars what the lady was selling them for and they're in such good condition like hardbacks and everything and like not a tear on them or anything like that. They're both by Lindsay Cummings. Um, all I know about this series is that the murder rate is higher than the birth rate. And the last thing that I picked up um, from Kijiji because I found a seller who was selling the box set of Percy Jackson and the Olympians for $15. I had this series when I was younger. I was like 16 and I had the entire original covers and I read them all and I loved the series and I gave them away and it was my biggest regret because I really would love to reread the series again and so um, my boyfriend has also never read this series so I'm really excited to reread this and for him to read it. 
I'm so happy I got to pick this up for super cheap and like they haven't even been opened. Um, so yeah, Percy Jackson and the Olympians, the new covers, so it's pretty cool. Okay, so that's everything for part one of my book haul. Um, I'm going to be doing part two really soon and that's going to be about books that I've picked up um, from bookstores really recently, not so much online, but actually physical bookstores. So yeah, I am so excited to bring that to you. So thanks so much for watching, and I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you later.